Good morning. So it's Tuesday. Not training today. We'll get into that a little later. Um, taking a few days of just like chill movement. Not gonna do nothing. So um, definitely still walking a ton, trying to get 10K steps a day. Um, but we're gonna start with some sled walking, um, some extension work for my knee. My knee's been feeling really, really good. So that is a huge blessing. Um, but yeah, gonna go walk some sleds. So like I was saying, uh, taking a little break, um, sometimes your body just needs some time, even though I don't like not doing my normal training, because I just love it. I, I really enjoy it, and um, especially this program right now, it's been super fun to like test out new things, um, just stuff I want to do like later on. Anyways, taking a little break, back to it tomorrow. Um, which will be good and body's feeling a lot better um, Just getting antsy to get back in there, but went on a walk went on a few walks Today just especially as I haven't been doing my normal training making sure that I'm still moving enough not like too much where my body's not resting but like get to getting 10,000 steps a day um, I'll do like 10 20 minute easy bike rides um, for my knee and I mean like really easy like I'm like just watching something on my phone or computer and like Damper is all the way at one. So very very easy um, But it is dinner time now had a really good work day um, And we are going to go over to see my mom in Lambo. Lambo always makes the days better Oh hi <laughs> Hi How's your day? Did you already have dinner? I think you did. She's like, mm, I don't think so. <laughs> All right, so for dinner, brought some food over. I have, presentation isn't ideal, but I've got some salmon, <laughs> which, which I think Lambo might want some. Uh, so we got some rice, kale, Salmon, a little bit of chicken as well, because I've got some protein uh, left in the macros. Rice, kale, uh, salmon, and chicken with some of the Trader Joe's green dragon sauce. And then for dessert, um, I've got I've got some dates that I cut in half, put a little pita butter in, some dark chocolate, and then sprinkled with sea salt. So I'll put those in the freezer for a bit. And then some spindrift. I never thought the day would come, but I actually, for whatever reason, I don't not like LaCroix anymore, but I just like Spindrift so much better, and I haven't had a LaCroix or like craved one in quite a while, so just going with Spindrift for now. So gonna have this, hang out with this one. I'll see you guys later. Hey guys, so it is the next day. I got to lift this morning, which was great. I'm trying to get some more mass back on my right leg, especially my hamstring. Um, definitely need to just really isolate that a little more or do some more specific things for getting it um, just 100% back. Um, but yeah, that went really well. And because I'm adding some more things in on top of like my hybrid strength stuff. It's just taking a little longer. So today, just to not be rushed, I split up, did all my lifting. So did squats, did some RDL variations. Um, on hybrid, it was dumbbell RDLs, but I did, um, or just regular RDLs, 
and I did a staggered stance just so I could go kind of just one leg at a time essentially. So did that, did some VMO sled pulls, which was fun. Um, and then just some like accessory work. Um, yeah, so that went well. I am sure I'm gonna be very sore tomorrow, but that's okay. Um, but now I'm at home and I am going to be doing, um, so today's hybrid workout had rowing intervals, but I'm going to bike instead, mostly because, so my elbow um, locked, or it didn't really lock up on me, like not the joint, but the muscles around it were very, very tight. Um, and honestly, so I was talking to my brother about it because I couldn't figure out why my elbow felt this way because I didn't do anything like different training wise and stuff like that, so it was super weird. And then Connor was like, you know, how is your work set up? Like, your, are your arms supported? And I was like, you know, no, they're not. And I honestly, not it might not be like 100% the only thing that was causing it, but I think it actually was a pretty big part of it. So I've just learned that I gotta like slide everything up on my desk and have my elbow supported, especially as I'm like, cause I'm using my mouse a lot and normally I would just have like my wrist supported. Um, and that just wasn't making my elbow feel good. So if you've had that problem, try like having, or just getting like a setup where you can have your elbow supportive. Um, supported, not supportive. <laughs> um, but uh, yeah, so that's helped a little bit um, and got it worked on so it feels a ton better. But instead, I'm also at home and long story short, I have my bike at home, don't have my rower. Um, and then I just wanna get this done at home instead of going back to the gym. Uh, tonight. So long tangent to just let you know that I'm doing uh, biking instead of rowing. So the rowing intervals were 750 at 2k pace, rest 115, 500 at 2k pace, rest 115, and then you do that again. Um, but because I'm doing it on the bike, I'm just doubling the meters. So it'll be 1500 rest, 1k rest, and then we'll do that again. And then I'm gonna do some of the core, and luckily I still have my handy dandy um, pull-up bar that I got uh, during quarantine, um, that I'm sure if you guys have been here for a while, I lots and lots of pull-ups and exercises done on that thing, and it's still, still holding up. Um, and I have my rings, so yeah, but I'll tell you guys more about that uh, when we get there. So first, biking. All right, so biking done, core workout. So this is the same one that I believe was in my last video or video before that. So it's uh, 12 <laughs> knee raises or knee to chest. Um, and then, wow, okay. I just looked at it too. And I've done this before. 12 hanging knee raises, eight to 10 rower pike ups. Don't have a rower, so I'm using like furniture mover things. I haven't tried this yet, so hopefully it works. So eight to 10 of those. And then a 30 second plank on ring, rings. Uh, and I'm gonna do that three times with about like a minute to two minutes uh, rest in between each round. Did not fall, so that's good. These are what I'm using. I'll put one on each foot. <laughs> okay, good morning. I just wanted to end the video. I hope you guys enjoyed it and I hope you guys are having an awesome day, awesome week. I will see you in the next one. Oh,